and we are back what's going on youtube i hope everyone's doing well it's been so long since we've posted but ma i am really sorry ma <laughs> i don't know what i'm saying i am really sorry about that because i've been so busy with life but here i am in turkey yes i'm in turkey today and uh, what i'm doing here you must be wondering i'm getting my teeth done so i thought how about I film this full process and give you more information anyone wants to come over to Turkey uh, and wants to get your teeth done or they want to know how it feels or stuff like that so I think I'm pretty sure it's like three or four days process I'm here for a week so it's Friday today I'm leaving next Friday uh, yeah I cannot wait and I cannot wait to share my experience as well uh, yeah first night I've literally been to hotels really nice they gave me options um, what hotel you want to stay in and I thought, do you know what, a good hotel, so, so they gave me a, like a five star hotel, uh, everyone around here living in these rooms, like literally in this hotel, uh, getting their teeth done and stuff, so I came in, I was starving, so I went for food, because it was dinner time, so uh, I had my food, I uh, spoke to a few people there, but people were really nice, uh, got to know some experience, how they're feeling, because some people are here for like, uh, they're here for like a couple of days, they've already been through the process, and I was like kind of interviewing them, oh, does it hurt, does it that? And then they, they seem quite happy, so I'm really excited because my first appointment's at 9 o'clock tomorrow morning, and uh, yeah, I'm buzzing, I am buzzing. So, do me a favour, like this video, subscribe to my channel, I'll go and have a quick first day session because this trip's going to be fitness, get my teeth done, be active, enjoy myself, I'm here myself, solo trip as well and after my chat, I'll take you through the process anyway so I'm gonna go and hit a session and yeah, catch you tomorrow morning, let's go! And I'm back, good morning and uh, yeah, I was running late this morning so I quickly grabbed breakfast at the hotel and then uh, they picked me up from the hotel took about 20 minutes from the hotel to uh, the clinic. clinic called, clinic's called the uh, Atelier Dentist in Antalya. Very good so far. That was sick, right? But yeah, uh, just gonna do bits and bobs done my forms and then after that we'll potentially get the treatment started today and the uh, people just walking by looking who's that who are you talking to yeah but yeah so I've done this form uh, they've given me a full form like you have to write all the rules and stuff but now I'm just going to I've done that I'm just waiting on them uh, gonna do my payment and then we'll start the treatment. Let's go. I'm excited and I'm back in action and responding and it's, it was day one It's been an interesting day because I uh, was, wasn't expecting everything going to get done today So I went to the clinic in the morning um, And obviously they took me through the x-rays and stuff like that. I think I done x-rays first and then uh, sat with the dentist uh, spoke about the treatment and then I needed some root canals uh, etc etc uh, and I need that extra, uh, extraction as well I still can't speak right <laughs> so uh, done all that made the payments and then they said we'll, we'll do the treatment we'll start the treatment today so they started filing up the teeth top and bottom uh, well plan was to get 10 uh, crowns uh, for the lower jaw Ugh, I can't even talk right now so yeah plan was to talk and uh, plan was to talk yeah, so plan was to get 10 uh, crowns for the lower jaw and 10 for the top, but what, what happened was they recommended 12 each, so yeah, uh, it was a bit costly, but it is what it is. It is what it is. But anyway, so yeah, it's been a really class day. I'd really sat like that for like um, eight hours, uh, just like literally. So they, filed, they were filing the teeth for the lower jaw and then the upper jaw, and uh, after that, yeah, yeah, I done my root canal and stuff like that, so it was it was all done perfect. Right now you can see uh, they look not bad too. Uh, so I'm gonna go and go back. Uh, second appointment gonna be on Wednesday. Uh, well, tomorrow's Sunday, near enough today because it's like one o'clock in the morning. Uh, so I'm gonna go back on Wednesday, get my actual ones uh, done, and then 
uh, they'll fit them back on so they'll take the temporary out and then they'll put the actual ones uh, but I'm so excited I've got three days to kill so I'm gonna uh, go and explore Antalya as much as I can I'll take you with me as well so uh, I hope you are enjoying the video if you are give it a quick subscribe like and let's go let's see what happens tomorrow let's go baby let's go Good morning people, it's day three, it's Monday today and I get my final fitting on Wednesday. It's been about two days now uh, since I've got my temporaries. Uh, yesterday uh, my face was a little swollen, it was like uh, I can feel a little bit of puffiness. Uh, but now I, I can talk alright, uh, I feel no pain at all and I'm feeling good. I literally went in down and I had breakfast. Yes, one thing I do mention, uh, what happens is when you're eating food, uh, because I've still got my actual back ones uh, at the back, so I chew. I can chew food with that. But with temperatures, it feels a bit weird e eating food. Uh, so you have to eat like really soft food. Uh, yeah, one thing you you should be aware of. Once you'll get your temperatures, uh, yeah. So forget about the food. Like nice food for like few days. You can't chew too much with the temperatures, but. Uh, yeah, it is doable, but a couple of days anyway, so I've got two more days with the temperatures, deep, deep <laughs> temperatures, because uh, and then I can't wait for the actual ones and eat, enjoy my food and stuff. But uh, anyway, uh, plan for today is uh, go and explore Antalya, because yesterday I didn't do that much, I just literally slept. Uh, just chilled, uh, so I'm going to go and quickly hit a session because it's Monday, International Chest Day, so I'm going to do a, ch a chest workout, quick chest workout downstairs in the gym, I'll show you that as well, and then uh, after that we'll go to Old Town, Antalya, it's about, I think it's about 40 minutes walk where, I, where I'm staying now, so, and it's a lovely route, so uh, I'll take you there, and up I meet Chan. Let's go. My friends say, get out of your comfort zone. It's a blessing in disguise. Get out of what you call home. Your name is written in the sky. It might feel just like you're on your own. But baby, it's another lie. Remember you were me. I try to fly. And I'm out, yes, finally out, uh, having a little gander around Italia. so I'm going to go and try and walk to Old Town, which is about 40 minutes walk, I think, uh, from where I'm staying, but I'm excited, I'm buzzing, look at the view, like literally in front of me, it's so good, uh, still struggling to talk, struggling, but yeah, it's good, let me show you, it is absolutely stunning, but uh, can't wait, let's go. Keep walking, keep talking, and uh, show you a bit. And is not 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 a bad place at all. Not a bad place. Let's go. And I am back in my hotel now, and uh, little tour was absolutely fantastic. Uh, I was exploring Antalya a little bit. Went to Old Town, uh, just looking at places. Looks actually quite decent. Uh, and a little update on my teeth, uh, temporaries are doing well now, they're fitting in quite well. Uh, yesterday I was struggling to eat food, uh, but I did manage to eat some chips and a chicken wrap. And today I feel like eating was a little bit more easier uh, than yesterday, or like first day. First day was really struggle because the temporary ones literally <laughs> don't fit in first day. So bear in mind, first day you go for your appointment. What happens is they file your teeth and then put these temporary on on so you can uh, uh, eat properly well so at least you can eat but uh, yeah they do take time to fit in and uh, sometimes i feel like you've got like a, see when you wrap a chewing gum around your teeth that's what it feels like right now like i've like like got like a quick, like big big piece of chewing gum attached to my teeth uh, but i cannot be I've only got one more day left. Wednesday, I'm getting the actual fitting. So, uh, tomorrow, plan for tomorrow is uh, I'm just going to chill tomorrow, just get a wee massage or something. Uh, but just yeah, try to make the most of it. Uh, but I do recommend uh, if you want to get your teeth done, 
do not come yourself because what happens is sometimes it gets boring. When I came in, weekend it was quite good. I met a lot of people, but um, now, like, literally there's no one outside. People just went home and stuff like that. So if you come with your mate or uh, anyone, your girlfriend, boyfriend, best mate, uh, you'll probably have a better time. So what I thought was, I thought I'll be in the clinic like five days in a row. Like every day I'll be getting little bits and bobs, but uh, they literally done the job in one day, like literally everything. And then they make you wait for like three days so they can prep for the actual uh, crowns or veneers, whatever you're getting. Uh, I'm getting a uh, crown, so yeah, I just need to wait for it in a couple of days. Do some tomorrow, uh, but if you enjoy your own company, you might want to come yourself, but if you're like a social butterfly like me, so uh, you want to come up with someone. So I would have brought Matthew with me, but uh, he was busy with work, and uh, if I knew I only had two appointments uh, during the week just to go to that clinic, so... I would have brought someone with me, but yeah, it is what it is. I'll make the most of it. I've got my laptop with me, so I'll do some editing and uh, just uh, watch telly, do you know what I mean? Like, enjoy myself. But anyway, enough of me chatting. That was my update for, what is it? So I got them done on Saturday, Sunday, Monday, yeah. So it's day two, day three uh, of the treatment. Uh, temporaries are going well. Uh, literally, uh, I can eat food now. Can't wait for Wednesday to get the actual ones. And uh, do you know what? On this note, I'll probably see you on Wednesday. Maybe tomorrow if I'm doing anything interesting. I'll, I'll do a little bit of vlogging. But uh, if not, then uh, yeah, catch you on Wednesday. So, quick update. I left my camera in the hotel room. But uh, the uh, place phoned me and said, come and get your teeth done today. Uh, because they were ready today instead of Wednesday so I'm buzzing, can't wait but before that I'm, I was starving I went for a gym session and then uh, I thought, you know what, grab some sushi uh, I'm at this beautiful sushi place uh, at the beach, absolutely class uh, going to get some sushi in and then going to get picked up uh, about 3.40 I think and then yeah, catch you then, let's go! <music> Good evening. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about because I can't talk properly right now because of injections. So I've got my actual ones, actual teeth in now, so actual crowns, which I'll be able to show you once I can talk. But I thought, why not give you a little reality of what happens when you actually get get them in? So they've in like they've put like injections at bottom. And then top for Zell. So right now, I feel like someone's holding my mouth. But uh, yeah, enough about chatting. Uh, I'll catch you once I can speak. Let's go. And I'm back. I can speak already right now. It's been about four hours, or yeah, four hours since uh, I got them in and got back to the hotel. But one side of my face is literally stuck because of the injections. Literally, I thought, you know what? I might as well keep it real. And keep you up to and keep you posted because uh, why not? We want to keep it real, we want to show you the experience of getting these crowns. So, uh, yeah, I ended up getting crowned in, crowns instead of veneers because that was a better option. Uh, but yeah, you can see, well, uh, I'll show you the proper ones tomorrow, but once I can open them up, uh, yeah, you can see the final product, they look all right. Went for the first color, but. Do you know what? I'm going to talk about it tomorrow once my face is looking alright. Oh my god, last and final update. I came in for my checkup, done, sorted, absolutely fine. Thieves are looking good and uh, I'm buzzing. Literally, job done in two days. Can't wait, can't wait to get back to the hotel and share with you the experience. But yeah, let's go. And I'm back. This is my last night in Turkey. And as you can see, I've got my... Uh, teeth done already now. Let me show you. Let me give you a quick tour of my teeth, <laughs> and then uh, we'll talk about uh, how was my experience, and uh, I'll give you a little advice, more information, and hopefully I can give you enough information for if anyone's looking to get their teeth done. But yeah, let's have a look at teeth. That's 
how my teeth are looking now. Absolute class. If you actually go back to the video, start of the video, I was sitting in the same place and uh, with my actual teeth. Uh, and you can go and have a look at that. Or you could just look on the screen. The old picture I've got right there. This is how uh, my teeth used to look like. I had a gap there and then I had a gap in the middle and then a few gaps at the side. So uh, again, uh, full experience. I would give 10 out of 10. The dentist I used in uh, Turkey was a uh, Italia dentist uh, in Antalya. If you are looking to get your teeth done, I would highly recommend them because first they arrived at uh, like airport, they picked me up from the airport in a like private car and then they brought me back to the hotel uh, and check-in was absolutely smooth. They gave me a very nice room and the uh, uh, hotel was half board, everything included. And then they used to pick me up from the uh, hotel to, to the clinic and then dropped me back off. So it was so good, it was like, it felt so unreal. And they, even the staff there was absolutely unreal as well. Uh, so yeah, highly recommend them. But a uh, process, so first day I went for my appointment, uh, we done the x-rays, sat with the dentist, we spoke about uh, what the treatment's going to be. I was looking to get veneers, uh, Emacs or porcelain ones, but then talking to the dentist, uh, she recommended, uh, shout out to my dentist, she was really nice, uh, but yeah, she recommended uh, I should get crowns instead because veneers going to be a bit too big and then they'll potentially fade as well and uh, they could break quite easily, so I ended up going for, I'm pretty sure I'm saying the name right, Zir Zirconium uh, crowns. Um, so I got 12 at the top and 12 bottom. You could see the uh, x-ray shot right there on the screen. So all the white bits on top of it, like that's literally them. But if the little like teeth, you can see that was my actual teeth. So it was a really good extra result so just to get the information. Uh, so yeah, we sat down, we spoke about it, and uh, I said, yeah, I'm absolutely fine. She recommended like uh, five root canals uh, and uh, some other uh, extraction at the back. Uh, so I said, absolutely fine. Uh, so after that, uh, my translator, uh, she took me downstairs. We spoke about the payment, and then she sh uh, showed me how much I need to pay. So I made the payment, and then we pretty much started the treatment there. Uh, so. Uh, the first thing they just started filing my lord jaw uh, I think it took about two and a half hours and then they done the uh, top jaw top jaw top <laughs> top bit uh, top teeth um, it took about three hours for that as well filing them down they do file them down to like little pegs 100% if you're getting crowns because if you're getting veneers there's less grinding but uh, less less grinding, less filing uh, for the teeth, but um, yeah, because I was getting crowned, so they did uh, file them down as much as they can, but obviously not up to the root, but so they can fit the actual crown on top of it. Uh, but yeah, we done that first day, and then they put done all my root canals and all the other treatment, and they did some gum treatment as well. So I done that. I was so good. So like literally you're getting your teeth done, but again, you're getting your checkup done at the same time as well, which was so good because uh, some of the stuff I didn't even know, like, oh, I had that problem. But, but yeah, so they put the temporaries on and then they told me, uh, come back after three days. And uh, uh, I said, that's absolutely fine. I'll come back after three days and I'll get my permanent one. So, um, so they, they phoned me on Tuesday. So I, I was meant to go back on Wednesday. Uh, but bear in mind, the actual first appointment was on Saturday, so they said come back on Wednesday and they uh, will do your thief. So what happened? So they, they phoned me on Tuesday morning saying your thieves are ready if you want to get them done today. I said absolutely buzzing, I, I just want to get them today. So what they do is uh, they let you try the thief, literally how you feel it, you feel good, they'll give you options, uh, uh, how you're feeling if you want them if you want them cemented or you want some changes to be made and uh, I said no absolutely fine so only thing I, I did choose was the these side bits because uh, we had that option either go for a little bit, little bit more natural look uh, like pointy uh, sides or you could just go straight like I've got right now so for my face I reckon straight was quite good so I went for that and uh, it, they took the teeth back to the uh, technicians, polished them, and then 
after that we were all ready to go and then it literally took I think uh, uh, 40 minutes to put the put all the teeth in, uh, smend them and uh, all that and uh, they told me don't eat after t like for two hours after that so I didn't eat anything at all but uh, I did get the injections when um, I was getting the teeth put in uh, what I would say is if you can handle the pain, if it's not pain it's just like little because uh, your actual teeth are sensitive once they're going in you'll feel a bit of kick but it's definitely worth not getting injections because uh, what happened was I couldn't move my face for like three four hours I lie I was lying in bed and I was literally crying <laughs> not not crying just like literally I was so frustrated because I couldn't move my cheeks at all they're still puffy because of the injections but uh, anyway it's all over now uh, if you are at, at that stage like if when you are getting your teeth put in I would say just say to them we don't want any injections uh, and uh, you'll be fine literally you'll be fine ready to go but that's me done today uh, so what happened was uh, there was a little bit of biting problem I was having uh, yesterday so I phoned them today I, not phoned them I just texted them I said can I get this checked literally believe it or not and within like 10 minutes taxi was outside the hotel and then I was at a clinic in like 50 20 minutes and um, clinic's not that far from me like 10 minutes and they, they checked it and then my lovely dentist whoever you are I love you <laughs> I actually know her name so I just don't want to say it just in case she's watching my video and then she's thinking why are you calling me out <laughs> but uh, yeah she was so nice uh, and love you from the bottom of my heart you give me a new smile but yeah so she checked it and then she done a little bit of uh, grinding on that like file of file the, the, the back teeth down and then uh, after that it was absolutely fine I had my dinner just there and it was so good like it felt like natural teeth like absolutely fine only problem I had was my lower gums uh, went a bit funny like started peeling because of the injections so I tell you thanks to you again they gave me the medicine they gave me like, this gum and the mouthwash uh, and I think it was like 300 uh, liters for that I paid which works out about 10 15 pounds something like that. but yeah so after that I used it for at night and today it's so much better I don't feel any pain at all so I'm, I'm going to be using that for about a week or so but yeah it was so good you could see the transformation and I really hope use I gave you enough information uh, for like if, if you want to get them done or not personally I would say if your teeth are not in bad condition and they uh, go for te teeth whitening or comps of bonding uh, but if they are like if you can like there's no other way then I think this is the best way to do it because uh, if you get like braces or but for me option one was uh, get braces and get composite bonding but composite bonding again costs you about two grand and uh, you have to you have to like uh, get, get it changed every five years because it fades as well best thing about these is they don't fade at all so uh, yeah that's I'm so happy I'm so happy with the results and the solo holiday was the experience was phenomenal because I came here first day was so boring second day I started meeting people and then you meet people you talk to people I was interviewing everyone like how's your experience going and stuff like that and then because I, I need to go through that and people are so nice and made so many friends but I would highly recommend it uh, if you want to build your character come here yourself and then talk to people and then you'll make friends or if you want to enjoy or make the most of this place as well bring your pal with you, bring your boyfriend, girlfriend, whoever and uh, you'll love this place because uh, literally it was, just, it was just so chilled, it was a really chilled place but yeah, I really hope I gave you enough information throughout that, how was my process and uh, uh, if you want to get it done you can watch my video and you're watching my video thank you so do me a favor drop a little like and subscribe to my channel um, and uh, that'll be so good and you can watch my new teeth in every video what i'll do is i'll do like a six months review uh, and then i'll i'll talk about how i'm feeling and how they're feeling and the most important part a, a part i didn't talk about they actually give you guarantee of um, you've got like uh, 
warranty, let's just say not guarantee, warranty. Uh, so you've got like seven years warranty. So anything goes wrong, you could get it changed or you could come to Turkey and get it changed. Because uh, there was a girl, she came back after like three years and because uh, uh, our uh, top tooth was shaking or something. Because she didn't wear a uh, mouth guard or anything like that. Mouth guard? Oh, they got a free mouth guard as well, uh, which is class because I need to wear it for gym and uh, night time as well. But yeah, seven years warranty as well. I really hope you've enjoyed the video. If you did, please subscribe, like, and if you've got any questions at all if, about my experience or about uh, this place, uh, I'll leave the place name in the description below and my Instagram. So if you've got any questions, just message me on Instagram because uh, I'll, I'll reply back to you and we can even have a quick chat and uh, I can share my experience if you if you want to get it done. Thank you very much for watching the video. I really hope I gave you good information because that's my job. Providing more information, teaching people, helping people. But yeah, thank you again and I will see you in the next video.